guys. Freak of four here. Back with uh, two more unboxings for you. Uh, I know exactly what's in these, but I had to share them because they are more retro uh, toys, so to speak, that that I grew up uh, playing with. description. Yeah, that's what she said. <laughs> but, uh, no, this is really cool, guys. Um, I'm not sure if you guys are familiar with what this is, but it is called a magic snake. And And the reason that this, you know, holds such nostalgic uh, vibes is the fact that this was one of the first toys that my parents introduced to me. Now, it isn't this particular one but it is the type of design, which is still really cool. Uh, um, yeah, so I'm I'm very stoked to to have that. And what you would do with it is. If you twisted and turned the pieces correctly, you could form a you could form a sphere or a sphere in this form, not to the point where you know it's completely spherical, you know, because you still have the corners and shit like that. But that is really fucking cool. I still have to track down the one or the two that I actually had because my parents didn't own this one. They had a blue, they had a blue and green one, not separate. It was it was blue with green uh, pieces. It was really cool. And then they had a giant one that was all uh, black and white. But, that's really fucking cool. Now this, see if I can, oh, uh, this one's going to be a bitch. Yeah, that didn't do anything. Didn't do a fucking thing. There we go. <laughs> oh my god, this is so fucking cool. Come on, buddy. It's time to open up. There we go. Alright. So this, guys, is very fucking cool. Throw that shit over there. 
I don't know if you guys can tell what this is here. Let me uh, open this up. Boy, they did an awesome job of wrapping it. Okay. Now, I know I forgot the bubble wrap in the last video, but God damn it, I won't forget this time. So, this right here, you guys, is unfucking believable to me that I'm holding this in my hands. What this is, is this is a Lego carrying case that I used to carry around with me to different destinations when I was a kid. And I actually had, I actually had, um, I actually had the, what word is it? The Tyco Super Building Blocks, uh, I believe it was the army set. It was with, I, apparently now it's called the, the Combat Battle Tank Set or something. But I had that in this. And I, when I was a kid, I actually built that tank. And it was like the coolest fucking thing I had ever seen in my entire life. And I will track down that particular Lego set because I want to build that tank so that I can share it with you guys because that's another thing that that means you know that not only means but it holds massive nostalgic vibes to my childhood so this is really fucking cool I could have sworn that this was a lot bigger, and, and but you have to understand that we're going back, we're going back probably 30 years, guys, you know, so it's possible that this may have looked ginormous to me as a kid, but in reality it was only this, you know, this big. But, uh, but yeah, that is fucking sick. And it feels so exhilarating to actually be holding that in my hand. It's unbelievable. Wow. So. And like I said... This is all for you, J-Love. Why did they put the damn tape on there? How am I supposed to pop the shit if the goddamn tape is on the goddamn bubble wrap? God damn. All right. Wow. Did they not want me to pop this? Because apparently that's what I'm getting at or seeing here. All right. There we go. All right, J-Love. This is all for you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, snack, crackle, pop, baby. Oh, that's a good one. Damn. Fuck. Getting a nice arm worked out here. Woo!
We've got some more right here. I thought I'd do it out. this video give it a thumbs up lets me know you're interested in what I'm doing and that means a lot to me and I will be back with some more exciting videos very soon later and stay terrified <laughs>